It's your boy Ray here and welcome back to another episode of Dragon Ball Legends guys love this game man. this game is actually so fun so we had a massive maintenance yesterday a 24 hour maintenance pretty much 24 hours it was going for as long as I can remember we're finally back into the game and we got so many new things hey guys just for you homies quick little game we could play is count how many times Ray says so in this video guys winner gets absolutely nothing but it's gonna be pretty funny for you to see how many times i say freaking so in this video i will work on that in the future try not to say it as much but regardless enjoy guys winner takes uh gets the pinned comment things that i want to go over with you guys today so many new things including how to get a free sparking unit for everybody guys they are being so generous with this update so starting off number one guys the game officially released on ios so it is out for all of you iphone users out there all of you apple users which is fantastic news as now it is available completely mobile uh, for anybody no matter what device you have the only thing is i don't know if it's released worldwide ios i know for sure it's released in canada as it was downloaded on my phone i woke up this morning and i'm sure it's going to be released in a few other places let me know any of you guys that are in the united states if you guys got it available on ios too i i feel like you did because i was getting a lot of comments today saying that they downloaded the game so congrats i'm super happy that's finally released and uh, if we take a look at the news I'm sure it'll give us a little bit more insight. So it says Dragon Ball Legends official global release now available to play worldwide. So it is available worldwide, which is amazing, guys. So they also have a release celebration where they're giving out a bunch of stuff. So um, the ultra ticket is one of the things and receive daily login bonus times two during the event. So every time you log in, you usually get 10 stones. Now you're getting 20, which is pretty cool. So let's go over all the new things they added. So first off, uh, they added... A few new missions into the game. I'm gonna give you guys uh, the rundown of the ones that have come out. So if you go on to our story, they released a whole new story on top of that as well. It's about, uh, I wanna say four or five missions, not too many. Um, actually, sorry, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine missions, very simple, very easy to beat. They give you a bunch of rewards uh, when you beat them and you also skyrocket your levels through these missions as every time you beat them, you also get I believe it's 30 Z tickets towards your next level, which is a decent amount considering it takes like around 200 to level, uh, to level up, at least at my rank at level 24. So complete all these is really good. Um, on top of that, uh, for stories, we also got new side stories, which is what I'm most excited for. So the Raditz event's still here. Still feel free to find this for another 12 days, but they added the Nappa event and they added the bonus battle XP and the bonus battle Zenny guys, which is amazing. So the Zenny one, of course, you can tell us for money, it gives you around 250,000 Zenny and the XP one will, I don't know how much XP it gives you roughly, but it gives you a lot and your characters skyrocket and it's all six characters in your slot, not just the three you take on the quest with you guys. So you can only do this once a day. They cost five stamina and then I think they refresh once every day. So it's a really good way to get Zenny. Of course, 250,000 isn't a lot, but it's better than nothing and it's actually like a decent amount for only five stamina guys um, on top of that they released the new uh chaotzu event which is just if you want to farm you're free to play chaotzu and it's also good for getting green soul boost guys you get a lot of green soul boost throughout this one star ones so if you guys got piccolo or any type of green character that you want to level up this is the event for you guys uh next up uh the napa event guys so this one's great for xp and coins as well, XP and Zenny. Uh, the last stage is very difficult. It's almost three max characters, 873 Raditz, 895 Vegeta, and 967 Nappa. Beat this and you have a chance to get these rewards. And these two are very good items. Uh, the Stay Alive Gohan, which is a silver equipment, and the Nappa, which it's called Die, which is a silver equipment. Um, once you max these out, you can also sell these for a bunch of Zenny, 10,000 a piece. And then on top of that, you're able to farm red and yellow soul boost level one and two red soul boost and only level two yellows but this is perfect if you're trying to farm that str goku guys so 
how do you get the free sparking ticket? Some of you guys may be asking. The free sparking ticket is acquired by doing three PvP battles. You have to win three PvP battles, and people might think, oh, it's hard, I just started the game. Well, if I were you, I would just hop into casual. Um, there's a lot of new players today, a lot of beginners, so it's not too hard to actually win this. And if you get a character at least to level 300, which you can relatively do within a day, if you use that uh, Cybermen XP grind, you can get three wins very, very easily. And from there, you will unlock the ticket, which will be in your rewards. And if you go on to summon, there it is, guys. The Sparking Ultra Ticket right there. Um, you can only get one, of course, it's for this event. But it's so cool that they're just giving everybody a guaranteed Sparking Unit. No matter who you get from this pool, they're all great. I would say um, the least, the character you want the least, unfortunately, is Pan. Uh, she has very good passive, but the problem with her is that she's just damage output-wise, she's very weak. Piccolo is the best unit in the game. Pycon's amazing, Vegeta's amazing, Goku's amazing, you unlock him free anyways, and um, yeah, and then there's Pan, and who's not bad, but isn't that great either, in, in my opinion, at least from what I experience. Um, on top of that, guys, even more news we got so far from this game is that we got so many rewards, so if you just start the game today, you will get 3,000 gems to start off with, which is three multi, so... I would re-roll, guys. I would keep re-rolling until you get the characters that you're looking for. Um, but 3,000 off the bat, as you guys can see, this is just um, from today. So 260 for the maintenance, 200 for the YouTube live celebration, 4.5 million downloads already, and the game just released globally, and we have 450 stones for that. And every time it hits, we're going to keep getting more and more, which is crazy. Um, and then apologies for an issue, they give us another 30. So I'm gonna collect these right now. I'm gonna accept all, and i almost at 3,000 already, guys. So as you can see, the login bonus from starting, you'll get 100 for the for the uh, 1 million pre-registered, uh, 200 for the 900 pre-registered, 2.5 million, and then 530,000. You get all of these. So you get around 3,000 to start, guys. And then it's very easy to farm. They release so many ways to get stones like i legit had guys a thousand one hundred yesterday and now i'm at two thousand nine hundred and i've done a few singles throughout the day today so like it's not like i haven't summoned at all so it's very very free to play friendly especially at this point in the game so i would highly stress you guys farm that so that is the big update guys i really hope you guys enjoy i'm gonna have a separate video for how to unlock the spear bomb goku and just do like a little damage test with him to show you guys what he's like um but besides that i really hope you guys enjoy uh, this update is crazy. So much new stuff has been added. Farm those events, guys. Farm that story mode. Get your characters high level. And especially um, this season because PvP this season is very important, guys. It's going to be ending. This PvP session is going to end on the 13th. So you only have two weeks to, com uh, to compete in this PvP season. But the season rewards are fantastic. As opposed to last time, hitting rank 50 would only get you 600 medals. Now it's 2,000 medals and 1 million zenny, which I really need desperately. Ranking rewards, getting first place in the season will get you 1,000 stones. I don't expect to get that. I don't expect any of you guys to get that, especially you guys are just starting now, but it's cool to have goals to work towards and then there's boosted characters. So play PvP, level up your characters, do what you gotta do, and honestly, Try to be the world's greatest legend, guys, like the game says. Uh, if you guys are interested in cheap, discounted, well, discounted uh, stones, aka, what are these? What are they called in this game? Crystals? They're called crystals in this game, right? If you guys are interested in cheaper, discounted crystals, uh, send me a message on my Facebook page. Just come, just come. You already, you already ruined it. You can send me a message on my Facebook page and I can help you out with that. As you can see, these are the Chrono Crystals. Also, something they added was the Assisto Bots, which I was wondering what those were at first, but if you click on details, so for $10 a month, um, Canadian, so it'd be $7.99 USD, you get uh, 40 Chrono Crystals every day, uh, every 24 hours um, for 30 days, guys. So that means uh, you get 40 times 30, which is... 1200 i believe you get 1200 stones for ten dollars which over the course of 30 days of course but if you check how much 1200 stones is normally it's 34.99 so it's a very good deal um, for those who are looking to passively get stones over time and then there's also a skip ticket one which gives you 10 skip tickets every day which skip tickets to me are pointless i have so many they just help you skip events but you don't want to skip any events if you can't beat it why would you want to go into the next event because you won't be able to do it then so uh yeah that is it. Thank you guys so much. Hope you guys enjoy. Subscribe if you are new uh, for more Legends content. I'm loving this game and I'm going to continue to pump up content for it. And I hope this game becomes big one day and I hope that uh, I can grow with this game and 
we can grow together as a community. So thank you guys. Have a great day, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.